Welcome to TravelNowSmart.com, the place where travelers and locals meet. In today's video, I'm going to talk about 14 best places to visit in Florida. If you've ever been to Florida, make sure you comment down below and let me know your favorite place. Also, follow us on Instagram at TravelNowSmart. And if you like the video, make sure you hit the like button, subscribe down below and click the notification bell so you get notified each time we post a new video. We will try to make it every other day, so make sure you stick around. At number 14 we have Sarasota Beach. Explore this large and unique beach in Sarasota. It's peaceful and quiet. Make sure you stay till darkness to see the amazing sunset. Also, explore other beaches nearby, as Sarasota has one of the most beautiful beaches in Florida. Siesta Beach is one of the most popular in Sarasota. The 8 mile island of Siesta Key is accessible by two bridges from the mainland. The place attracts families during the day and party goers during the night. At number 13 we have Jacksonville. Jacksonville is a large city in northeastern Florida where the St. John's River meets the Atlantic Ocean. It's a regional business center with many museums and cultural offerings. Swimming and surfing are popular at nearby island beaches such as Jacksonville Beach and Baton Beach. Jacksonville is considered one of the best value destinations in the world. Expect vacation that is full of fun and relaxing as well. The youngest population of Florida lives in Jacksonville, so there's plenty to do all day long. Jacksonville has been ranked as one of the best value destinations by Lonely Planet and as one of the super cool cities in the US by Expedia. At number 12 we have Ponce de Leon Springs. Ponce de Leon Springs State Park has a water temperature remaining constantly at 68 degrees Fahrenheit all year round. The main spring is a convergence of two underground water flows and produces 14 million gallons of water every single day. Visitors can take a walk along two nature trails featuring a lush forest and learn more about the wildlife. Get some swimming done in a clear water and after that visit the historic museum and archives. You won't be able to see any fishes as it is more like a pool. You can even rent a kayak, canoe and tubes. Also make sure to eat breakfast at the sugar milk pancake house. Your mom will be thankful. Definitely one of the best places to visit in Florida. At number 11 we have Bahia Honda State Park. Explore one of the most beautiful state parks in Florida and also the only place in the Keys with a unique and clean beach. You can camp, swim, snorkel, sunbathe and much more. The beautiful sunset you get to see is mesmerizing. I'd suggest to go early or late as it can get crowded during the day. It is definitely one of the best places to visit in Florida at number 11 on our list. Number 10 is Vacula Springs State Park. Home to the world's largest and deepest freshwater springs, the crystal clear water of Vacula Springs boasts manatees, alligators and hosts of diverse wildlife that can be viewed from a riverboat or the adjacent diving platform. The water's average temperature of 70 degrees Fahrenheit is sure to refresh you even on the hottest day in Florida. The ancient cypress swamps made a perfect backdrop for old Hollywood movies. The history of this place is dating back thousands of years. You can also visit the unique Spanish style lodge with its period furniture, original elevators and colorful painted ceilings. One of the best parks in Florida, hands down. Prepare to see a lot of wildlife like manatees, turtles, birds and even gators. You can take a cruise and captains will tell you a lot more about the area. You can even jump into the water from two story platform. At number 9 we have Pensacola Beach. Located on the western tip of Florida, stretching miles along the Gulf of Mexico, this unique very island offers a vast range of experiences. From lifeguarded main beaches to the quiet secluded beaches of Gulf Island. No matter your style, relax on the sunny and peaceful shores of Pensacola Beach. Called Jewel of the Gulf, this beach is one of the best in Florida. The sand is soft and pristine white, the water aqua blue and warm. The downtown Pensacola is not far and you can find many popular stores and restaurants. 
definitely one of the best places to see Florida and number 9 on our list. At number 8 we have Homosasa Springs Wildlife State Park. If you want to see manatees and other wildlife all year round, this is a place to be. You can find free rescue manatees, collection of birds, gators, hippos and much more. There is even an underwater observatory and during certain times the animals are being fed. The walkway is nicely done and there is numerous information all around. The entrance fee is 14 for adults and you can expect to spend around 2 hours there. At number 7 we have Naples Beach. Explore one of the most prettiest beaches in Florida. The water of the Gulf of Mexico is refreshing and warm. Add a wide sand beach and you get a perfect vacation spot. Make sure you go up to the pier and look for dolphins. I saw many of them all around. Definitely one of the best places to visit in Florida at number 7 on our list. Number 6 we have the Everglades National Park. The Everglades National Park is located in South Florida that is well known for its boat tours to see the alligators and other wildlife. The park consists of 1.5 million acres of wetland. There are plenty of activities to do. You can take the Anhinga Trail to see the abundant wildlife like tourists, Aerons and of course the alligator. Then you can visit the Shark Valley 65 foot high observation deck to get a better view of the glades. Get on the boat tour or kayak for a chance to see a crocodile, manatee, or even dolphins. Later, which is the sunsets over Flamingo, the southernmost point in mainland Florida. Explore the pinelands by bike, paddle amongst the mangroves, or tour the historic Nine Hercules. I recommend buying the tickets online on Groupon, which can save you even $15 per person. Remember that there is no cell signal in the park, so just make a screenshot of the tickets. It is definitely one of the best national parks in the United States if you want to see alligator. At number 5 we have the Dry Tortugas National Park. Located almost 70 miles west of Key West, it's accessible only by boat or seaplane. The park is well known for its rich history as well as home to the magnificent Fort Jefferson. Pristine beaches, rich marine life and the vast inhibition of birds that frequent the area. It is another park that I have visited and would absolutely recommend. It can be pretty hard to get to as it is an island located around 1 hour from Key West in Florida. You have to take a boat called Yankee Freedom that goes directly to Dry Tortugas National Park. Once you board the ferry, you will get breakfast which is included in the price. Then you spend around 1 hour getting to the island. You should take the opportunity and go out to see some dolphins. When you arrive, you get a snorkeling gear for free which you should absolutely use. Just be careful of jellyfish as they can be present during some times. Explore the island and make sure to see the fort. Other than that, just relax and enjoy the peace as the Yankee Ferry is the only boat that goes there. <laughs> At number 4 we have Key West. Probably the most popular destination in Florida. It's the most southern place in the United States, just 90 miles from Cuba. Perfect destination for diving and snorkeling. The scenic drive will take you around 2 hours from Miami. If you have never been to Key West, you are in for a great treat. The best option of attractions will make sure everyone is content with that trip or vacation. Some of the most popular attractions are dolphin encounters, kayaking the backcountry, diving and snorkeling. You can even rent a boat at Key West Marina and explore the unique area on your own. For those who want to relax and enjoy their vacation, simply choose from a plethora of pristine beaches. Stroll around the popular Mallory Square or Duval Street. 
plenty of restaurants, bars and shops nearby. At number 3 we have Orlando. As number one travel destination in the United States, this well-known city doesn't even need introduction. Located in Central Florida, Orlando is famous for its theme parks, Walt Disney World being the most famous one. Another major destination is the Universal Studio, where movies are being shot. Orlando has also many shopping malls, so use that as an opportunity to shop. At number 2 we have St. Augustine. Located on the northeast coast of Florida, it is considered as one of the oldest cities in the US. Well known for its Spanish colonial architecture as well as more than 42 miles of pristine beaches, St. Augustine set itself apart from any other city in the country by having unique scenery and history. The city resembles a European flavor with centuries old buildings horse-drawn carriages, hidden courtyards, and so much more. Explore more than 450 years worth of history in this unique and fascinating city. More than 6 million people visit St. Augustine each year, so make sure you become one of them. At number 1 we have Miami South Beach. Another popular beach and of course one of the best beaches in Miami. It has a long and amazing beach close to restaurants, shopping malls and more. It is not much crowded during the off season. A great place to take a long walk along the beach on a nice paved walkway. There are also places along the beach to buy water, soda, ice cream and more. The ocean is perfect and warm to take a swim. The sand feels like a powder. The ocean is very clean and there is enough space for everyone. The Miami South Beach can get crowded during the peak season, so if you want more peace just drive to a nearby Key Bissini to relax. I hope you enjoyed the video about the 14 best places to visit in Florida. If you did, make sure you hit the like button, subscribe down below and hit the notification bell so you get notified each time we post a new video. We will try to make it every other day, so make sure you stick around. Also, follow us on Instagram at travelnowsmart.